Did you know you can see the Earth's shadow and curvature without waiting for a lunar eclipse? See the dark area on the horizon? That dark area is called Earth's shadow. The pink area above it is called Belt of Venus. Earth's shadow is caused by the Earth itself. It is viewed during the civil stage of twilight when the sun is 1 and 6 degrees below the horizon. It appears as a dark blue band that stretches 180 degrees of the horizon opposite of the sun either before sunrise or after sunset. It is slightly wedge shaped with the curvature of the earth. The best conditions to see it is when the sky is clear, higher elevation, and unobstructed view of the horizon. The pink color above the dark area is called the belt of Venus. It is due to a scattering of red light. Sunlight appears reddish due to light going through the thickest part of the atmosphere near the horizon, filtering out all the other colors except for red. Same concept here, the red light is scattered back near the horizon from the observer's view which causes the pink color of the belt of Venus. As the sun gets lower below the horizon, the less defined the boundaries between the Earth's shadow and the belt of Venus as you can see here. Since red light is no longer scattered, the observer will see a normal blue sky. The sun is about 10 degrees below the horizon at this point due to the Earth's rotation. Here is a drawing on the concept of how the belt of Venus and the Earth's shadow works. Video showing Earth's curved shadow by Willie Quartz taken at the South Africa's Southern Observatory. Elevation is 1,798 meters. Featured behind the domes of the South African Astronomical Observatory in Sutherland is the bluish wedge-shaped shadow of the Earth bounded above by the pinkish anti-twilight arc known as the belt of Venus. The observing plateau of the Sutherland Observatory with its 360 degree horizons and raised above the surrounding landscape is ideal for observing this phenomena, particularly the Earth's shadow itself. This footage was filmed over three evenings near the equinox. Wikipedia describes the belt of Venus or Venus's girdle as an atmospheric phenomenon seen at sunrise and sunset visible along the anti-sunward horizon. Shortly after sunset, or shortly before sunrise, the observer is surrounded by a pinkish glow that extends roughly 10 to 20 degrees above the horizon. The arc's light pink color is due to backscattering of reddened light from the rising or setting sun. Often this glow is separated from the horizon by a dark layer, the Earth's shadow or so-called dark segment. This time lapse shows the Earth's shadow rise above the eastern horizon after sunset with the pink belt above it where the sun's rays still illuminate the atmosphere. When looking over the edge of the plateau, the hilltop's shadow can be seen racing away towards the horizon. When it reaches the horizon, one can clearly see it continue into the atmosphere as a bluish wedge, getting thicker all the time. At first the separation between the two is very distinct, but as it gets darker, they tend to dissolve into each other. As the pink sunlit atmosphere above it fades away, Springbok grays the vegetation around the robotic telescope domes. A special thank you and shout out to Mr. Willie Quartz. Please subscribe to him. The link is in the description box.